You all want to know what Gambians eat, right? The most famous, what's the most famous dish in Gambia? We have a lot of dishes, but Ebe is one of the favorite because many young people take it all the time. Young people? Young people. What about the old people? They too take it, but <laughs> the reason why I said young people is because if you, if you want to have any dish at any time of the day, mm -hmm. people always ask for Ebe. And that's because it's very, very spicy and it's kind of an appetizer before you can have a main dish. Wow. Yes. Let's go find out. Yes. Yeah, so Ebe, huh? You should try it. Yeah, I'm going to try Ebe. Oh, oh my goodness. Ebe. So this is Eba? No, it's Ebe. Oh, Ebe. Yes. I've been using Eba all the time. You know, the Nigerian Eba, so I keep on saying Eba. Eba, you know. The name is what? Ebe. E-B-B-E-H. E -B -B -E Wow. Yes, Ebe, so not Eba. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's a spicy food, okay. so that's why most young people eat it, like I said um, wow. initially. Yeah. So what it's made out of is they use cassava for it. They use cassava. Yes, and wow. but, palm but oil. Cassava? Cassava, yes. But I, I thought people in Gambia don't eat fufu. <laughs> no, we do eat fufu, but fufu is not like a Gambian dish, okay. except for the Akus who make it. And the Nigerian restaurants, you okay. can get fufu Food from there or from wow. the Israel Unions. But when you talk about Gambian dishes, that's when you talk about Benechin, you talk about Supakanja, you wow. talk about stew, um, that, that's what we call chew, chew. either chew jin, chew yapa, wow. and ebe and the likes. Ebe. So, like ebe is made of cassava? And yes, ebe. and there is fish in it, fish smoked in it. fish. Smoked fish? Yes. And it looks like palm oil. Yes, there is palm oil there too. And no, you spice. know, like, this, this looks like a dish in Ghana. Mm -hmm. I actually forget the name, but um, what's the name? What's the name? Kokoyam porridge. <laughs> How come you know all these things? Like, well, I've been to Ghana. I love Ghana. Ghana. Yes. Wow, what's your favorite Ghanaian dish? Watch it. Everyone loves wache. I love wache. Wow. I, when I'm in Ghana, uh -huh. I, I can eat wache every time. Like all the time during the day. Wow. And Ghanaians are like, you don't have to eat wache all the time, you know, you can try out that. I'm like, you know what, let me stick to wache. Wow, yes. now I'm gonna stick to a bed. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> Like, can, I, can you show us the right way to? Well, it, it's simple. There are spoons, okay. and each of the spoons go with each you want to eat. Okay. Then this is the seafood. You have uh, shrimps in it. You okay. also have crab. Right. And this is what we call dahar. It's, it's kind of, um, how do I call it? it it's sour. It tastes sour. So it makes the food really spicy. Wow. You can try it alone, or you can have it in the ebe, like that. You can mix it. Oh my god. Then you try it. This one is too soft. So you can just put it yeah. and mix it. Like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't know whether ever will be my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> We're right now at Homeway. Mm -hmm. And Homeway is the best place you can get. A really nicely nice. cooked ebe, homemade wow. ebe. Wow. Yes. Wow, this is so good. Mm -hmm. right? no, no, I really understand why a lot of Gambians were telling me to go try ebe. Ebe, <laughs> ebe, <laughs> ebe is too nice. Spicy, man. Too spicy. Yes, it's too spicy. Too spicy. Gambians naturally love spicy food. Really? Just mm. Gambians, eh? Huh? Yes, naturally yeah, love spicy food. Can you try the Ghana pepper? Uh, yes, I did. The green and the red. Oh yes. <laughs> I came to Gambia, I feel at home because most of your dishes just look like exactly like what we eat in Ghana. Mm -hmm. Because almost all the dishes you can find pepper in it. Not like when you go to East Africa, they don't eat pepper at all. Oh, they don't? And not at all. Well, I've not been there. So you gotta try it out. I've been there. So you can, you can still make it more spicy. Mm -hmm. I can just... Or if you want, you can use a crab in mm -hmm. Try it with the seafood. Mm -hmm. So sometimes too, when you are sick and you don't like have anything to eat, you can just get a bit really spicy. It helps you gain your appetite. Wow. Yes. This is so good, right? I love the fact that you got spices in it, mm -hmm. and it, it has carbohydrate. Also, the everything cassava, cassava and all. You know, there is protein. protein. It's balanced. Mm -hmm. Really, really balanced. Uh, but it, it, you don't have okra in it. 
Oh no. <laughs> no. But how come it has this uh, sticky color? That's because um has starch. St oh. Yes. So yeah. that's why it's. Mm -hmm. uh, I like they add okra. Mm. Yeah, we have an okra It's called super kanja. Oh, you also have okra soup here. Mm. We call it super kanja. Wow. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. So that's seafood. You can just try it. So that's it. This one I have to use my hand? Oh, you can use your hand and grab a bite and okay. all that. <laughs> See? Grab my bite, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> So it's always mm, this, uh, mm -hmm. and this is mm. Have you tried crabs before? Yeah, of course. Mm, that's it. Try crab and mm. yeah. Wow. So like, do you, do you guys eat um, at Bedouin special occasions like weddings and stuff? Mm. Especially during birthday ceremonies, mm -hmm. people make ebe. So there was a time that. <laughs> Salonians and Nigerians are like, how can you prepare a day for a birthday? <laughs> but it's, it's made, especially for a takeaway. Yeah. When people have birthdays, when they have weddings, if yeah. necessary, they make a bear in the white bowls and they wow. serve it to guests that come to attend wow. the program. Wow. Yes. Wow. This is really good and trust me, I, can, I will surely recommend this. That whenever you come to the Gambia, make sure you try a bear. Because like, trust me, it has all the nutrition that you need. Mm -hmm. Protein, carbohydrate, vitamin, all of them. It's a balanced diet. And I really enjoyed it. That's what I'm recommending it to you. But how much does it cost? Like all the one that we have on our table. Um, for this, each plate is hundred. Hundred. So it's um three hundred. Three hundred. Yes. Which is very cheap. Yeah, but it, it can be cheaper. The price, the prices vary. Yeah. But because this is the best place, you can get really nice one with everything. Oh, on okay. It. So that's why it's a. So this is the best, best place to eat a bear. Yes, the best place I know. No. So many other people can make very nice. So if, if you go to other places, it, could, it can even be cheaper. Yeah, it can be cheaper. Oh my yeah. goodness, man. Then next time, take me to the cheap place because I'm from <laughs> the village. I don't like expensive places. No problem. Yeah. Okay. No problem. Oh my god. Anything you want to tell them? I want to say Gambia is home. Thank you. Gambia is the main coast of Africa. Oh, that's why I keep on when you go, <laughs> when you go outside, you hear so many stories, especially those that have never been yeah. to this country before. Yeah. But Gambia is the best place you can have fun. Mm -hmm. You can see beautiful places. Our beaches are lovely. We have oh. very nice historical places that you can also visit. Yeah. I'm sure you have not tried there I'm Fort Bulen. Oh, perfect. Jufre and the like. So all of those are historical places that really yeah. signifies our heritage and culture. So you can try those places okay. and also see. So you're always welcome to the smiling coast of Africa. We're always smiling. It's a beautiful country to be in. And I would say that don't forget to smile. Because <laughs> we are shooting this video right from the smiling coast of Africa. The Gambia. I am Maya. No, hold on. I am. <laughs> Let me open your mouth. You all show me your mouth. One. To open your mind. <laughs> 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 <laughs>